March 31st, Heedfulness versus Hypocrisy in Ourselves If any man see his brother sin a sin which is not unto death, he shall ask, and he shall give him life for them that sin not unto death. 1 John 5.16 If we are not heedful of the way the Spirit of God works in us, we will become spiritual hypocrites. We see where other folks are failing, and we turn our discernment into the gibe of criticism instead of into intercession on their behalf. The revelation is made to us not through the acuteness of our minds, but by the direct penetration of the Spirit of God. And if we are not heedful of the source of the revelation, we become criticizing centers and forget that God says, He shall ask, and He shall give Him life for them that sin not unto death. Take care lest you play the hypocrite by spending all your time trying to get others right before you worship God yourself. One of the subtlest burdens God ever puts on us as saints is this burden of discernment concerning other souls. He reveals things so that we may take the burden of these souls before Him and form the mind of Christ about them as we intercede on His line. God says He will give us life for them that sin not unto death. It is not that we bring God into touch with our minds, but that we rouse ourselves until God is able to convey His mind to us about the one for whom we intercede. Is Jesus Christ seeing the travail of His soul in us? He cannot unless we are so identified with Himself that we are roused up to get His view about the people for whom we pray. May we learn to intercede so wholeheartedly that Jesus Christ will be satisfied with us as intercessors.